So we're given a set of vectors, and we're asked to determine which of the two vectors are parallel. We need to recall that if we have an angle theta, the subscript ij, if that's the angle between vectors v sub i and v sub j, then we'll have the cosine of theta ij is equal to the dot product of vector i and vector j divided by the magnitude of vector i times the magnitude of vector j. So for each of these four vectors, we're going to look at the different pairs and find out what the cosine of theta is for each of those. So we'll have the cosine theta subscript 1, 2. So we're looking at vectors 1 and vector 2. If we put in our components, we'll get 4 times negative 3 plus 6 times negative 6 divided by the square root of 52 times the square root of 45. So here the numerator is the dot product of vectors 1 and 2. The square root of 52 is the magnitude of vector 1. The square root of 45 is the magnitude of vector 2. If we clean this up, we'll get this is roughly negative 0 0.992. If we proceed in the same way for the remaining pairs, we'll get cosine theta of vectors 1 and 3. Turns out to be negative 0 0.124. Cosine of theta for vectors 1 and 4 turns out to be 1. Cosine of theta for vectors 2 and 3 turns out to be zero. The cosine of theta for vectors two and four turns out to be negative 0 0.992. And lastly, the cosine of theta for vectors three and four turns out to be negative 0 0.124. Now two vectors are parallel, the cosine of the angle between them is equal to one. When we look at our resulting cosines, we see that the cosine of theta for vectors 1 and 4 is equal to 1, and so vectors 1 and 4 are parallel.